Frozen Cortex is a big success on the most important level. Developer Mode7Games created an awesome sci-fi sport that blends some of the best parts of American football and rugby into a turn-based content. It's tactically demanding and exciting to watch and play. It just needs a little more meat on its bones. The rules of Cortex are straightforward and deceptively similar to football. The offense is trying to get to the end zone at the south end of the field. If they do, they get seven points. If there is a turnover, play continues, but with the offense going north. You can only run or pass in a forward direction. But that handful of rules generates endless variety as two coaches draw up plans for each of their players during their next turn. Especially against another human, it's a nerve-wracking game of slow-motion competitive mind-reading, full of suspense and agonizing mental gymnastics as you design plans based on what you think the other coach might try. The randomly generated fields help keep things fresh. Wide open space is a scarce commodity, as the typical frozen cortex pitch is carved up into a maze by these low barriers, which allow passes but block runs, and high barriers, which deny both passes and runs. One field might promote lots of open field passing and running, while another turns into Space Hulk Rugby as players brawl at tight intersections. I've had a few dud maps now and then, but fortunately, each game is over in 12 turns, so you don't have to sit around getting stomped if you have a bad game. More often than not, the fate of the game hangs in the balance until the very end. Frozen Cortex also wraps a more traditional sports management sim around its tactical game, but is disappointingly slim. A vague story about corruption in Pro Cortex is conveyed by tedious talking heads, and the franchise management mode hints at possibilities like recruiting specialist players and budget-breaking superstars to augment your lineup. But with play limited to just one season, there's no depth to it beyond hiring a few new robo-players with money earned via games or wagering. It helps that Frozen Cortex looks and sounds just great. While the style is fairly minimalist, as it is in Mode 7's similar tactical shooter, Frozen Synapse, the quality is far higher across the board. The art, and especially the music, give it a sleek, icy futurist vibe, and the cinematic cam shows this excellent game of robot and robot violence to great effect. For more on Frozen Cortex, keep on an IGN.